If I love you, I show you I love you every day. Little things, big things. Think back five years ago, think of where you're at today, think ahead five years and what you want to accomplish. Be unstoppable. One of the most important things you can accomplish is just being yourself. Be the person that when your feet touch the floor in the morning the devil says, oh shit, they are up. All success begins with self-discipline. It starts with you. When you walk up to opportunity's door, don't knock it, kick that bitch in, smile and introduce yourself. When you walk up to opportunity's door, don't knock it, kick that bitch in, smile and introduce yourself. Success isn't always about greatness. It's about consistency. Consistent hard work gains success. Greatness will come. If something stands between you and your success, move it. Never be denied. Be humble. Be hungry. And always be the hardest worker in the room. You don't need directions. Just point yourself to the top and go. Success isn't overnight. It's when every day you get a little better than the day before. It all adds up. I like to use the hard times in the past to motivate me today. The first step in achieving your goal is to take a minute to respect your goal, know what it means to you to achieve it. The first step in achieving your goal is to take a minute to respect your goal, know what it means to you to achieve it. When life puts you in touch situations, don't say why me, just say try me. When life puts you in touch situations, don't say why me, just say try me. Don't be afraid to be ambitious about your goals. Hard work never stops. Neither should your dreams. Success at anything will always come down to this, focus and effort. And we control both. Success at anything will always come down to this, focus and effort. And we control both. With drive and a bit of talent you can move mountains. Wake up determined, go to bed satisfied. Not only do I think being nice and kind is easy, but being kind, in my opinion, is important. The wall. Your success is on the other side. Can't jump over it or go around it. You know what to do. I grew up in a musical family, the majority of my growing up was done in Hawaii. It's what we do. You sing, you dance, you play ukulele and you drink. I want someone who can trust that my big hands are going to take care of them. I like the idea of working in different genres and transcending genres and hopefully finding success and ultimately make movies people like. I'm very low-key. I don't really blend in, so it's difficult to go out in public. I like to do things that are kind of quiet, whether it's a dinner at my house or a restaurant, or a movie night at home. Training for me is a metaphor for life, period. The dedication, the determination, the desire, the work ethic, the great successes and the great failures, I take that into life. I grew up where, when a door closed, a window didn't open. The only thing I had was cracks. I'd do everything to get through those cracks, scratch, claw, bite, push, bleed. Now the opportunity is here. The door is wide open, and it's as big as a garage. It's not about the car you drive. It's about the size of your arm hanging out of the window. I like to use the hard times of the past to motivate me today. You either play the game or let the game play you. Keep calm and shut your mouth. Two things happen when an athlete gets injured. Some guys say, F it, I'm going to wait it out three to four months. But with me and lots of other athletes, you find your eighth or ninth gear, a gear you've never gone to before, and say, I'm going to come back. My philosophy is, it's always very rewarding when you can make an audience laugh. I don't mind making fun of myself. I like self-deprecating comedy. But I'd like you to laugh with me occasionally, too. Grind hard, shine hard. It's you versus you. The single most powerful thing I can be is to be myself. I was raised by strong women, and that DNA is in my daughter and wife. 